Hej, siama do wam wszystkim ludzie, z tej strony Arturo, witam was na swoim kanale i kontynuujemy The Book on Unwritten Tales. Moi drodzy, w dalszym ciągu gramy i Porozmawialiśmy sobie z ogrami i otrzymaliśmy jakieś przebranie. Gdzie to przebranie będę mógł wykorzystać, nie mam zielonego pojęcia. Aczkolwiek, jeżeli przełączymy się na Wilbura, musimy zdobyć źródło światła. Inaczej nie przedostaniemy się do tamtej jaskini. Jak powiedziałem na koniec poprzedniego odcinka, być może to przebranie będziemy mogli założyć i dostać się w ten sposób do szkoły. Okej, okay, chyba je założyłem. Aczkolwiek, dobra, widzę, że mamy tylko i wyłącznie jakieś gogle na twarzy. Porozmawiaj z Eter i Gulliverem. Jestem ciekaw, czy mnie poznają, kiedy mam te okulary na twarzy. I don't want to confuse them with my disguise. They'll end up thinking it's normal being spoken to in a friendly tone by stra... No właśnie. Nie mogę z nimi porozmawiać. Tutaj był strażnik, którego się pozbyliśmy. From celebrated hero to enemy of the state... Hmm, steep career path for Wilbur. When the cat's away, the mice will play. Let's go in. No i świetnie. W tym stroju już nie było problemu, żeby się tu dostać. What the? You could have hit me. Yeah, whatever. No one's allowed to enter the school as long as the council leader's away. Jestem tu oficjalnie z polecenia przewodniczącej rady. Council leader Van Buren has asked me to get something from her office for her. She didn't tell me. She only told me to knock the head off anyone who tries to get in here while she's away. Oh, presumably she forgot to mention it. She'll be very angry if I don't bring her what she requested. Angry with you, not with me. Oh, jak jest ciebie wspaniały strażnik, najlepszy z najlepszych. Oh, somebody's really on the ball here and really decisive. Well done. Yeah, no problem for a professional like me. Oh, I'll mention that in my report. What report? Oh, I'm not really permitted to tell you, but um, let's just say a positive evaluation should give your career a boost. But I'm exactly where I want to be. Really? Sure, otherwise I wouldn't be here. Naprawdę podoba ci się twoja praca, prawda? You really must have a ball every day harassing people. A smart guy like me can really make good in this world. But you're destined for greater things. Go out there and prove it. I could, but I don't want to. Let everyone else bumble around if they want to. They always come crawling back asking for help at some point. And I just say, deal with your own shit, you bumblers. Ha! Oh, what a delightful conversation. Well, it's no surprise you liked it. Conversations with the one and only Grumder Klimpus are always a laugh. It was rather disappointing for me. But you did your best. No dobra, czyli gościu nie wpuści mnie do szkoły, tak? Nie mogę przejść. His general appearance is not exactly pleasant. Think you're something special, because you know all these long words, eh? Czyli będziemy musieli wykombinować inny sposób. Być może Wilbur w jakiś sposób mi pomoże. I can't risk starting a fight with a troll. Yeah, I could get past him, but he might follow me and wake up half the town in the process. Annoyingly, I can't trick him either. He's just too stupid for that. <sighs> no właśnie. O, tu jest latarenka. Moglibyśmy ją wziąć, przekazać Wilburowi i mógłby w ten sposób dostać się do jaskini. Pójdę i z nim pogadam. Wilba? Yes? Troll pilnuje szkoły. Nie mogę wejść do pokoju nauczycielskiego. Is there another way into the school? Um, if we had some fireplace travel powder, you could get into the staff room through the fireplace. Fireplace? I'm sure there isn't a fireplace in there. Presumably it's now a doll's house or something. Maybe the fireplace in the library is still okay. 
Worth a try. Just missing the powder now. It's on the headmaster's desk. Oh, which brings us back to the start of our problem. Yep. That's about the size of it. That's all for now. See you later. Dobra, ale jeszcze chcę coś sprawdzić. Jak się przyłączę na Wilbura i kliknę na rozmowę z Eve, czy będą te same opcje dialogowe, czy jednak inne? The basket will let Ivo and I exchange stuff. Very handy if one of us gets stuck at something. Ale co ja bym mógł przekazać Eve, skoro ja nic nie mam? Ivo? What? Hmm. Co robisz w kamieniu morskim? Not that I'm not overjoyed to see you, but what are you doing in Seastone? I need to talk to Archmage Alistair. There's a little uh, problem. Unless it's about catching flies with your tongue, he's not going to be any help to you at the moment. Well, the problem can wait. I hope. Wiesz może gdzie mógł by ukrywać się Mankus? Mankus has completely disappeared since the fight in the staff room. Do you think he's still in town? Yes, I fear so. Like flies to Arbor's pot, dark sorcerers are attracted to power. A little girl with seemingly unlimited magic. He'll try anything to exploit that. And he can transform himself into anyone. Be careful about whom you trust up there. Who says he's up here? He could be down there with you. We must both keep our eyes peeled. Czy zmiany w mieście są aż tak drastyczne, jak opowiadał nam Remy? Remy said that much of the city has been transformed. Is it really that bad? Some buildings have been badly affected, but nothing that couldn't be fixed with a few flaming torches. What's worse is that some people have also been transformed, and no one dares to say what they think anymore. That is terrible! Van Buren's intoxicated by power, worse than Joffrey. She's insane, she's going to ruin our world, and she has the means to do it. Luckily you're here, Ivo. We'll stop them. Wouldn't be the first time. Gdzie jest Van Buren? Strzeż się tej kobiety. Where's the council leader? Whatever you do, don't let her catch you. It's okay. She's on her way to the elf burrow. She wants to pay my mother a visit. Doesn't that worry you? Nah, she'll get nowhere in the elf burrow. Elf protective magic is powerful. So it's just a question of how long it takes Van Buren to figure that out. She'll be furious. It's best we're no longer here by the time she gets back. Potrzebuję światła. Możesz mi pomóc? For my search for Remy, I need something I can use to light an entire cave. I'll keep my eyes peeled. Thanks. I have to get going. Don't get caught. Good luck. Keep your ears stiff. Okay. Wydaje mi się, że teraz dzięki tej rozmowie z Eve mogę się na nią przełączyć. I być może będę mógł zabrać tą lampę, którą tu widzieliśmy. Spójrz na wiadro. A bucket with an evil smelling sticky slimy substance. If I ever need anything like this, I'll know where to find it. Okay. A nie, jednak nie. Jednak w dalszym ciągu ta lampa jest nieinteraktywna. A szkoda, bo myślałem, że będę mógł ją zabrać i przekazać Wilburowi. Czyli musimy znaleźć jakiś inny sposób na światło. Ja nie wiem, czy ja w tej masce powinienem chodzić. Mogę ją zdjąć? Mogę chyba, nie? Hi, you two. Oh, hello. Witajcie w mieście. Nazywam się Ivo. I've not had the pleasure of making your acquaintance yet. My name's Ivo. Welcome to Seastone. My name is Gulliver. This is my enchanting lotus blossom, Esther. Our son down there with the ogre is called Nate. Nate? Nate, yes. Named after a true hero and good friend. It was down to him that Esther and I got together back then in the Wildlands. Uh, a kem, nie natknęliście się ostatnio na Nate'a? About Nate? You haven't seen him recently, have you? Unfortunately not. We would have loved to have had him at our wedding, but he suddenly disappeared. I'm sure he's out there in the big wide world, helping other lovers find the happiness they deserve. But he left his love behind in the process. Do you... do you know him? That deceitful hypocrite who disappeared in the middle of the night with no explanation and leaving me standing there like an idiot of a pirate? No, I don't know him. Not anymore. 
A mimo to go szuka. Co teraz zrobicie? Gdzie zamierzacie się udać? It's not safe for you here in Seastone. Not for anyone. I know, but where else can we go? Zombies and the undead aren't really welcome anywhere. People think that we eat their brains. But to be honest, they really don't taste of anything. Ugh. Well, perhaps you'd be better off in the Wildlands. There are loads of monst... um... people like you there. Why do we have to go? Just because other people have a problem with us? That's not fair. Może sam zajmiesz się produkcją tabliczek, gdy będzie już po wszystkim. Wilbur talked about the machine that you built together. Maybe you can bring it up here and build slates for yourself when everything's returned to normal. I don't think so. Only Bill knows where to get the intelligent stone. And he'd claim I've stolen his idea. He can afford ghouls, worse, lawyers. Anyway, where am I going to get the gold? Who would even lend me a copper piece? Don't give up, sunshine. Small setbacks are a part of death. Esther's right. Those who fight may lose, but those who don't fight have lost already. Says the young, pretty and rich elf princess. I've got to go now. Bye, you two. Bye. Bye. Naprawdę są bardzo sympatyczni. Niestety nie mają żadnego źródła światła. Spójrz na robota. Dobra, porozmawiamy sobie z ogrami. Oni na pewno będą mieli jakiś pomysł. Hello, Zlof. Blout. <laughs> Jak się po sucie uderza. Ah, Princess Ivo. Hmm. Czy twoja wiedza magiczna obejmuje sposoby oświetlenia dużych jaskiń? A friend of mine who's active in the uh, non-existent resistance has to somehow illuminate a big cave. I'm no longer a mage and have nothing to do with the resistance. And because I'm no longer a mage, I don't need my magical equipment anymore. Like, for example, this clicker which can capture starlight. Good job that you aren't a mage anymore. Now I can give this thing to my friend, who's not on a wanted list and who's also not in the resistance, which also doesn't even exist. Why talk so strange? Something not right here. You're much too suspicious, dear Blout. Thanks for the chat. You were like a beacon of light in the darkness of night. No dobra, czyli otrzymałem klikacza, który łapie światło, tak? Zloth called this thing a clicker. Apparently one can use it to capture starlight. I know some fluorescing plants that collect sunlight during the day and then give it out at night. Perhaps it's something like that. Czyli muszę znaleźć jakieś gwiazdy, z których będę mógł pobrać światło. Tu są gwiazdy. Ale raczej nie są świecące. Chyba, że będę mógł gdzieś w jakiejś lokacji na niebo spojrzeć. Pójdę na samą górę, bo wydaje mi się, że tam jakieś niebo widać. O właśnie, spójrz na rozgwieżdżone niebo. It all seems quiet and peaceful looking into the starlit sky. However, there are unbelievable powers and great tragedies occurring up there. We just don't look carefully enough. Sprawdźmy, czy kiedy użyję na tym klikacza, to zbiorę ich światło. Right then, capture starlight. Hmm. That is beautiful. No i świetnie. A skoro mogę przekazywać e, przedmioty między sobą a Wilburem, zróbmy to. Wilbur? Yes? I've captured a bit of starlight for you. That should make your light problems a thing of the past. Really? Wow! I'm going to send the clicker down in the basket. You must wait until you're in the dark cave before you set the starlight free. Got it! No dobra, zatem przyłączmy się na Wilbura. The basket will let Ivo and I exchange stuff. Very handy if one of us gets stuck at some point. Klikacz mamy już w ekwipunku. OK. Czyli nie pozostaje nam nic innego jak zejść ponownie w dół, no i rozświetlić to jaskinie.
Wow! Oh, that's bright. I can see. By God, you've got old. You're only statues. We are gods trapped in statues. That, by the way, is a very exciting story. Could someone help me up? Thank you. Hey, hey, all this light reminds me of a joke. Two trolls look up into the night sky. One asks the other, what do you think? Is there life on the moon? And the other replies, well, of course, there's a light on, isn't there? <laughs> Maybe you could just lie him face down in the sand. Te dowcipy są naprawdę mega żenujące. So you're gods in statues. And so it came to pass that the young hero encountered the epic story. The statues depict us. They are our last. I always thought gods lived somewhere up in the sky in really stylish cloud palaces. I have lived in many temples, all of which were dedicated to me. The faithful met in them, discussing and answering the most difficult of questions. And they all paid homage to me, the god of riddles. <laughs> and then you were forgotten and ate sand for a few centuries. <laughs> that one calls himself Jerry, the god of bad jokes. Uh, the god of humor. That is Avini. Hypnis, the chatterbox. The god of good stories. One picture speaks more than a thousand. Okay, ja nie wiem, czy chcę z nimi rozmawiać. Spójrz na jezioro. This lake looks weird. The water is so dark and somehow oh, wrong. Oh, it's real water. Then I could just swim to the island. Oh, <laughs> I wouldn't try that if I were you. And if I build a raft and get myself a small rowing boat? No boat can cross this lake, spoke the mighty voice of the highest of the gods. We can only explain to you how to get over the lake. Dobra, ale nie po to przyszedłem tutaj, żeby podziwiać to jezioro, ale po to, żeby znaleźć Remiego. That's Remy's shrinking ring. That means he was here. Remy! Skoro mamy jego pierścień, to być może będziemy mogli ponownie się pomniejszyć. I kiedy wejdziemy sobie do mysiej Nory, to powinniśmy wyjść w gabinecie dyrektora. Tam zdobędziemy prawdopodobnie proszek, który będziemy mogli przekazać If. Ha, no właśnie, tylko w jaki sposób potem If dostaniemy się do biblioteki? An island in the lake with the ruins of the creepiest temple I've ever seen. Dobra, chyba Remiego jednak tutaj nigdzie nie ma. Być może faktycznie przedostał się na drugą stronę przez to jezioro. Hello, said the young hero, and then asked that. Jesteś bogiem opowieści. Uwielbiam opowieści. I've always liked stories, especially the story of the knight Ni as he rode out to slay the evil dragon. Yes, one of my finest. You wrote the Night Knee story? I wrote all the stories, so to speak. Boy falls in love with girl, hooker with a heart, happy ending, all my inventions. Everything since is just variations on a theme, really. Wow! I also invented the words and, wide, and jam, as well as the letters E, Q, and L. Oh, and the Oxford comma. Wciąż nie rozumiem, dlaczego bogowie żyją tu w rzeźbach. I still don't understand why you're here and not somewhere beautiful instead. I mean, you're gods. Can't you do whatever you want? Of course we can. Uh, well, theoretically. In reality, though, no one has believed in us for a long while. Do you know how gods are created, young man? I... I thought all of the gods had always been there. Nah. We get our power by people believing in us. It can be a great power. A power that can move mountains. 
and flare up conflict. But if no one believes in you anymore, nothing remains. Our temples were destroyed centuries ago, or rededicated to other more bloodthirsty gods. These four statues are all... If they disappear, we, like our religion, will cease to exist. Muszę dostać się na tamtą wyspę. Pomożesz mi? I think my friend Remy's on the island over there. How can I cross to it? Now, it's quite simple. No, it isn't. First he's got to answer some riddles. Oh, we've already done with the light. Can't we simply get on with the story now? Previously, people honored us, gave us offerings, erected temples. I can't build you a temple. No, but you can honor us, so that we will bestow our favor upon you. Hmm. You are, um, awesome. How pitiful. You must give each of us an offering, or fulfill for each of us one wish. Or something like that. Yes, yes, and only when you've won over three of us will we reveal how you can cross the dark water safely. People, gods, whatever you are, this isn't a game. Remy may be in danger. When he is in the temple of the Nameless One, <laughs> for sure. Another reason for you to hurry, chop chop, mortal. Win our favor. Opowiedz mi o świątyni na wyspie. You said that the temple on the island was for the nameless one. That's right. Hundreds of years ago, the nameless one grew ever more mighty, winning over an increasing amount of followers. Of course, the priests of the other gods were very unhappy about this, so they forbade the name of this god to be spoken, his symbols to be worn, or for prayers to be said to him. Those who were versed in the dark arts and wanted to use the god's power for their own purposes built this temple deep under the town. They performed forbidden rituals there and increased the might of the god. In return, he gave them untold power. That doesn't sound good. It wasn't. At some point or other, they were discovered and the temple destroyed. Shortly thereafter, the nameless one was banished and for centuries all was peaceful on the island. Co się stało ze świątynią, gdy już została zniszczona? And then what happened to the temple? What happened next? A few years ago, men appeared. They visited the temple and held rituals there. Rituals we had not witnessed for centuries. Dark mages, who had delved too deeply into old books and found the whereabouts of the temple. They built a machine, the purpose of which we can only speculate over. Maybe they wanted to bring the nameless one back to this world. If that was their aim, they didn't succeed. The island lapsed back into peaceful darkness. I suspect the mages had been killed. Ah, then my wand might have belonged to one of the dark mages. I don't know anything about magic wands. I just know that for several years the temple has been inhabited by a ghost which never leaves. And Remy's just gone there. That reminds me of an old story. Shortly before the first amphibians... Um... Sorry, I just don't have time for long stories at the moment. Oh, of course. But just run along then. Check out the neighborhood for stuff and try to make sense of it all. Czy muszę coś dla ciebie zrobić, żebyś mi pomógł? What do you want me to do? Nothing. My vote would be to get the story moving again. We agree that he has to complete a task for each of us. But you don't know what happens on the island. It will be very exciting and very emotional. Oscar worthy. What's happening on the island? Down here, riddles must be solved if you want to get any further. Just like in the good old days. <sighs> okay then, a task. <clears throat> Tell me a story. That's hardly a suitable task. Storytelling is not easy. It has to be a creative, exciting story that meets my exacting standards. Come on, gnome. Think up a story to knock us off our feet. Młody farmer na planecie o dwóch słońcach. Chłopiec, który mieszka pod schodami w swoich złych krewnych. O, Harry Potter. Archeolog, który ledwo uciekł przed wielkim, toczącym się głazem. An archaeologist who uh, just barely escapes a huge stone ball. Nagle widzi białego królika z kieszonkowym zegarkiem. Staje nieoczekiwanie odwiedzony przez 13 krasnoludów. Zauważa, że ma nadludzkie moce. 
chce rozpocząć nowe życie po drugiej stronie oceanu i wsiada na niezatopialny statek. So he wants to start a new life across the ocean and boards a ship, an unsinkable one. Aha, gripping storyline, exciting characters. The first act is complete. What are the further developments and climax going to be? Spotyka człowieka, który pokazuje mu czerwoną i niebieską pigułkę, a później jest głodny i musi walczyć na śmierć i życie z innymi na arenie. Później zostaje kapitanem i walczy z zombie i ośmiornicą i piratami, a później, kiedy jego ojciec umiera, on zostaje głową rodu i mści się krwawo. Później. So yes, then he he becomes a captain and is faced with a zombie and squid and pirates until later. Może uciec z akwarium, w którym cały czas był uwięziony. Krzyżuje strumienie z przyjaciółmi i w ten sposób pokonuje duchy. On i Jenny spotkają się po środku wielkiej wody. Jego przyjaciel robot zostaje opuszczony do kadziei z roztopionym żelazem. He and Jenny see each other in the middle of the water. And then the twist. Ten sam dzień rozpoczynał się ciągle od nowa. Przez cały czas był martwy. To był sen w śnie w śnie. On jest Kejzerem Sousem. To był sen w śnie w śnie. So it was, it, it was a dream. In a dream, in a dream. Ah, very original. But... You've got my support, my young friend. So, one got down, two to go. Okay. Hi. Hello. Więc jesteś boginią sztuki. The art? Is that like when you make a face out of macaroni and glue it to some paper? Art is everywhere. There is nothing in this world that isn't art. That's why I'm the most important goddess here. The world consists of stories. Now you both know the world would be terribly dull without a good laugh. Every time a painter picks up his brush, a sculptor his chisel, or a bard his lute, they are singing my praises. The painters and sculptors sing too. Leave it, gnome. She's not so good with words. Co mogę dla ciebie zrobić, aby zyskać twoje względy? And what do I have to do to gain your favor? Hmm. Well, you don't appear to have a cup of wine on you. Can you dance? Of course. Okay, my first request, don't. And don't ever think about dancing again. Hmm. Painting, sculpture, music. How do you fare in these arts? To be honest, I'm a cracking dancer, but I'm rubbish at everything else. <laughs> Then, best leave art to the professionals, like myself. I would love to sing again, but I really can't remember what the notes sound like. Bring me a tuning fork or something of that kind. When I hear the notes, I'm sure it would all come flooding back to me. Czyli muszę jej przynieść jakiś instrument muzyczny, tak? No dobra. I have to go. Go. You. Oh, young friend, would you like? Book humor, brzmi jak świetne zajęcie. The god of humor. Wow. Oh, of course. It'd be a sorry state of affairs if I didn't. <laughs> It is really bad if one constant. Oh, you just haven't got a sense of humor. Listen, one politician says to the other, I don't know why no one likes, or, or do you know? Uh, yes. Hmm. Party poop. Jesteś w tak dobrym nastroju, że z pewnością pomożesz mi bez żądania czegoś w zamian, prawda? As you're in such a good mood, you'll help me get to the island, right? Oh, comedians always have a dark side. It's not easy making everyone else laugh. And what do you know about... I am the god of humor. I invented... Yes, only so that people will know when they... Oh, yeah. Two cannibals are eating a clam. Eh? Ah. You see? Eh? It's a tough business making people roll in the eye. That's the task I'll set you, mortal. You want me to tell you a joke? One that's so funny, it makes my stomach ache with laughter. Oh, it'll happen. Okej. Okay. Dobra, strasznie przegadana jest ta gierka. Aż za bardzo mi się wydaje. Czyli mamy 
pierścień skurczający. Timmy, znasz jakiś dowcip? Timmy? Nie? Na dole jest wyspa ze świątynią. Jestem przekonany, że znajdę tam twojego wuja Remiego. There's a dark lake down there with an island in the middle with a ruined temple on it. I'm pretty sure that's where your uncle is. Haven't you had a look yet? I don't know how to get across the lake. That water looks suspicious and the statues of the gods say no boat or raft can cross the lake. H how did Uncle Remy get to the island then? I guess he knows the secret of how to cross the lake safely. So don't worry, I'll figure it out. Znalazłem pierścień Remiego. He never puts that down. It was on the edge of a suspicious looking lake. Or perhaps, perhaps he wanted you to have it. I... I don't think so. He couldn't have known that I would follow him. Of course he knew that. You wouldn't leave a friend in need. Everyone knows that except you. Znasz jakieś dobre dowcipy, Timmy? Do you know any good jokes, Timmy? Is this really an appropriate time for jokes? I need a good joke to get your uncle out of the temple. It's a long story. I've kinda got one. What do us rats like playing most? Hide and squeak. <laughs> not bad. It's not funny because I've got to get back. You can do it. To nie był zbyt zabawny dowcip. Może szczura mama będzie znała dowcipy. Hi Ethel. Ooh, ooh. You always have. Znalazłem skurczający pierścień Remiego. I um I found Remy's ring. It was lying down there on the shore of a dark lake. Oh, he never leaves that ring lying around anywhere. He's always saying that magic rings aren't a toy. You have to bring Monsieur de Dumas back to me. Us, in one piece, Wilbur. I'll do my best. Znasz jakieś dobre dowcipy, Ethel? Don't ask why, but you have to tell me a good joke. Hmm. Hmm. Uh, uh, two hydrocarbons meet. One says, hi. The other answers, ah, go away, you're substituted. Come on, tell me a joke. That, uh, um, was one. Old alchemist joke. I don't get it. If you're not part of the solution, then you're part of the condensate. No need to insult me. I'm dead serious. I... Your mother is so ugly, not even fluorine would combine with her. Now you're even insulting my mother. I just want you to tell me a joke. Oh, uh, something like, uh, so this cannibal cook says to the captive, can you please whistle when the water boils? Yeah, something like that. I uh, don't know any jokes like that. Uh, oh, well, then I'll use... I have to be going, Ethel. If you need stew, you know where to find... Czyli ona nie za bardzo mi pomogła. Wejdź do szkoły. But with Remy's shrinking ring, I could fit. Spójrz na walkę. A lot of the stuff here is made out of this smooth, shiny material. I don't know what it is, but I do know I find it kind of eerie. I wouldn't want to run into this doll in the dark. Hmm, the doll has a ring on its back. I wonder if you... Love me. Not again. I've done a poo-poo. Shall we sing a song? Hmm? Professor Weathervane? Ah, uh, um, it's, it's not what it looks like. So you're not trying to liberate the frog? Więc to chyba to, na co wygląda. So, well, maybe there is something to it. You, you're not calling for help. It is my duty. Dlaczego pracuje pan dla przewodniczącej rady? Nie widzi pan co ona wyrabia? How can you work for Van Buren? Don't you know what she's doing to this city and its people? I it it is not for me to judge her politics. I'm just a simple civil servant who must obey his superiors no matter what they do. Even if she's as mad as a cuckoo clock. Since the death of the Archmage. Sybil Van Buren is my new employer and it's my duty to serve her loyally. Ja, ja nie przemieniłem arcymaga. I didn't transform the Archmage. I hope you know that. 
Of course I know that. The very idea is... Ah. Archmage Alistair was Professor Doctor 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 of Magic. You are just a graduate mage and not even a real teacher. It's completely implausible that someone like you could defeat the Archmage in a duel. Um, thanks. It was Chantal Van Buren. She cast a spell on him with that cursed wand, just like she's done with everything else, right? That's right. But how does she do it? It's impossible for a little girl to have such power. We believe that she... Stop. I... I don't want to know. I'm a loyal civil servant. I work for the council leader. The less knowledge I need to conceal from her, the better. Doktorze Bloch, niech pan nam pomoże. Please, headmaster. You could do so much good. You could start by taking the chains off the jar. Betray my mistress? Never. However, well, it's time to call it a day. I will lock the door and admonish the guard troll to be vigilant. But the fact that I've seen a gnome here, perhaps I'll forget to mention that. That's very kind of you. I shall have to write a negative evaluation in my own file for this. Good evening, Professor, and good luck. Lock yourself. No one is to get into the office, you hear? Whew, that could have backfired badly. Being rat size isn't all it's cracked up to be. Dobra, ale my potrzebujemy proszku, tak? Który znajduje się prawdopodobnie na tym biurku. Hmm, lots of papers, quills, ink stains and the... nothing interesting. Weź małe pudełko. This time, I'm just going to take the whole tin. It's for... Spójrz na cymbałki. Świetnie. Parents often say it looks like a bomb exploded. Usually it's just an exaggeration, but here it might. Czyli będziemy mieli nutki. Hmm, it's an old model. I wonder if. Welcome back, Professor Weathervane. It's my old slate. The traitorous thing. I only do what I am programmed to do. All evil is on your side of the screen, not mine. Who ordered you to deceive me? Username, Monkus Rules 1. I see! I'll take you with me, but don't get any big ideas about me trusting you again. What a hideous creature! Ah! Uh, probably best if I leave the way I came. And I'm not going back to town until I've saved. No, dobra. Wróćmy się zatem z powrotem do jaskini. Udało nam się zdobyć cymbałki, więc prawdopodobnie zadanie z notami będziemy mieli odznaczone i pozostanie nam jeszcze tylko i wyłącznie zadanie z dowcipem którego no, na tą chwilę dobrego dowcipu nie znamy. Ale może i zna jakiś dowcip, albo y, ogry na górze. Listen to this. Oh, the music, notes, semiquavers, vibrato. It's all coming back to me. Not bad, eh? I'm a natural. Whoa. Ooh. Oh -ho! That's it. I thank you, Morty. I'm going to practice every day so that I don't forget the notes again. Oh, great. And that's two gods in the bag. Dobra, jeszcze proszę, musimy przekazać Eve. No i przy okazji zapytamy się, czy nie zna jakichś dowcipów. Yes. I 
borrowed a box of fireplace travel powder from the headmaster's desk. Brilliant! I can really do with that. But there's another problem! Headmaster Block has locked the door to the staff room. So what are we going to do now? It's easy. I'll send up the magic slate. It can repeat the door code. No, ale jeszcze będziemy musieli się trolla w jakiś sposób pozbyć. Handy to have a little friend who can do all the work for you. Thanks. Nie mogę od razu tych dwóch elementów tutaj umieścić? Ivo? What? Pod miastem znajduje się świątynia poświęcona złemu bogowi. Did you know that there's a temple under the city? It's dedicated to an evil deity called the Nameless One. Well, that's not really his name, of course. He has a name, and it isn't the Nameless One, but... I know the legends, but what sort of temple are you talking about? There were people who worshipped the Nameless One. They built a temple using a machine. Maybe they wanted to bring him back to this world. I'm also pretty certain it's where Remy found the magic wand. Oh, then you should take a closer look at the temple. I'm working on it. Mam skurczający pierścień Remiego. Może się przydać. I found Remy's shrinking ring. I can use it to get back to the school through the pipes. Great. That should help us. Znasz jakieś dobre dowcipy? Do you know any good jokes, Ivo? Are you kidding me? Is that, are you kidding me, of course I know good jokes, or are you kidding me, how should I know any good jokes? Are you pulling my leg? Why in the name of all the gods do you want me to tell you a joke? Funny you should mention gods, they are involved. One in particular. Could you please just ask around? I need a really good joke, one that can make a stone statue of a god laugh. Of course. Thanks. Podobno na wyspie jest duch. The island is supposed to be guarded by a ghost. I find that disturbing. Can't you cast a spell over it? You must know that. I never looked into that. I always thought that was too scary. Oh, I'll see what I can do. Yeah, do that. I have to get going. Good luck. Czyli tak czy inaczej musimy przełączyć się na Eve i zdobyć jakieś dowcipy. Hi, you two. Oh, hello. Nie znasz może jakichś dobrych dowcipów? Don't ask me why, but Wilbur wants to learn a few good jokes. Do you know any? But of course. After being examined, the patient asks, Doctor, is there anything you can do for me? To which the doctor replies, Certainly, I'll prescribe you a couple of mud baths. And they'll help? Of course, the doctor says, it'll help you to get used to the feeling of being buried. <laughs> Oh, I still remember the damp earth. For a long time, I thought if only you'd let yourself be cremated. Oh, okay. Wiesz wszystko o duchach, prawda? I bet you know all about ghosts, don't you? I used to share a flat with some. Do you happen to know how to cast a spell on a ghost? Hmm? No, no idea. But I do know that ghosts don't stick to cleaning rosters, and they don't use doors, and that could really give you a terrible shock. I've got to go now. Bye. Bye. W sumie ten dowcip nie był taki zły. Hello, Zlof. Ah, oh, princess. Hmm. Potrzebuję dowcipu. This, well, this might seem a little bit weird, but could you please tell me a joke? Why weird? A joke can lift the spirits in times of great adversity. No joke? Oh, Blout, your jokes are always so... That's why good jokes, two statues stand in park, face each other for hundreds of years. One be young man, other be young woman. Both... Here we go again. Then God appear. He says, I grant you biggest wish. Both can leave plinth for one hour. Both disappear in bushes. 
rustling, whispering, giggling. Man pants, ten minutes left. She reply, OK, now you hold pigeon and I sit on it. <laughs> <laughs> Prince! Oh, apologies. Albo tego nie zrozumiałem, albo mnie to nie rozśmieszyło. You don't happen to have enough. No, lots more jokes. With... The princess doesn't want to hear them. Anyway, you've all... <laughs> the town guard asks the mage head of a two-headed ogre, so you deny breaking a fence post in two on your brother's head? To which the ogre replies, I can't deny that, but I didn't do it on purpose. So you didn't intend to hit him? Oh, I did. But I didn't intend to break the fence post in the process. <laughs> Not fine. Of course it's funny. Thanks very much for the jokes, Loth. I will... You see. Wiesz, jak rzucić zaklęcie na ducha? I could do with knowing how to cast a spell on a ghost. Do you know anything about that? I know, I know. Very scared of ghosts. As you know, one fears nothing more than the unknown. And if one knows nothing... One fears everything. Ghosts evil, steal blout socks, but always just left. Of course, it's always just our left socks that are missing. That's your side. I look after my sock. So what about ghost spells then? I know you can keep ghosts at bay with certain symbols. Blout has protector amulet with symbols on. Czy mogę dostać twój amulet? The amulet. Protect me from ghosts. Works good. Not attacked by ghosts so far. Could I borrow it, please? No. Then Blout unprotected. The amulet depicts the magic circle, but it's not magical. Blout got it from the bargain bin for three copper pieces. It could still come in useful. It's mine. Won't give. I would try to persuade him, but it's hopeless. He's almost as scared of ghosts as he is of the young Van Buren. Może mogłabym zaoferować ci coś w zamian za amulet? Blout, how about I give you something in exchange for the amulet? I've got um, a, a stone which protects you from the evil eye. Ever since I've had it, I've not been hit by any curses. Give you five gold pieces for it. I don't want to sell the stone. I want to swap it for your amulet. But Blout want to be protected from ghosts and evil eye. <sighs> Naprawdę pilnie potrzebuję tego amuletu. A life could depend on you giving me that amulet. Blout's life depend on keeping it. Perhaps ghosts come tonight. <sighs> This isn't going to work. Thanks for the... You were like a... Dobra, będziemy musieli znaleźć jakiś inny sposób, żeby go przekonać do tego, aby pożyczył nam amulet. Bądź dał. Ale skoro znamy dowcipy, to przekażmy je Wilburowi. Wilbur. Yes? I've got this joke about a pain. Who would have thought? After being examined, the dog and it'll of course is that I don't Blouts. Perhaps a okay. Trochę je przewinę. Po co je słuchać drugi raz? I've never used fireplace travel powder before. You have to throw it in a fire. And then you walk into the flames and concentrate hard on the symbols of the fireplace in which you want to come. Aha. And those are? Um, the icons on the fireplace in the library, you know. I've never been there. Have you not memorized them? Of course. They were... Sowa, robak, szczur chyba. Orzeł, kret i pingwin. Lew, niedźwiedź, polarny i gąsienica albo coś takiego. Lion, po... Or something like... Well, it, it might have been an owl, a worm and a rat. Oh. Or maybe an eagle, a mo... Oh, I'm gonna... F That's all for... See you later. No dobra, skoro znamy dowcipy, wykonajmy już to zadanie do końca. Wydaje mi się, że najlepszy dowcip to będzie z tą rzeźbą. Biorąc pod uwagę fakt, że też gadamy z rzeźbami. No ale... Żaden z tych dowcipów nie był jakoś specjalnie zabawny. Juhu. Oh, yeah. So, I heard this joke. I'm listening. So, three... No, wait. One says, hello. Whereupon the other says, 
Ah! Go! Are you? I. I, I thought you might. I know a joke. What do rats hide and squeak? <laughs> <laughs> that was so predictable. I thought that was very me too. Well, which once again proved no, I didn't. I have a joke. Hit me. This is a joke about a doctor and his patient. I think it's the only one of its kind. After being examined, the patient asks, "Doctor, can you help me?" The doctor replies, "Of course. I'm going to prescribe you a mud bath." "And it'll help?" asks the patient. "Of course," the doctor says. It'll help you get used to the feeling of being buried. Hmm, <laughs> 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 that was even worse than... Come on, that was good. Oh, sure. Did you see me laughing? I know a joke with statues and gods. I'm sure you like it. Oh, that sounds good. For hundreds of years, these two statues were in a park opposite each other. One is a young man, the other a young woman. Both are naked, so one day a god appears and grants them their greatest wish. They are permitted to leave their respective plinths for an hour. Both immediately disappear into the undergrowth. There's rustling. We've still got ten minutes. The young man gasps, and she replies, "Great, let's switch places. You hold the pigeon, and I'll crap on it." <laughs> <laughs> that wouldn't even bring a tired smile to the faces of your audience. But well, to an audience with a sense of humour, there's only one of them here, and he didn't laugh. Myślałem, że moje dowcipy są dobre i nie śmiali. Well, I thought my jokes were good and the others laughed. Oh, that's irrelevant. I have to laugh. But you only seem to laugh at your own jokes. Because they're the best ones. But that's... Wait a minute. Dwóch kanibali a clowna. Two cannibals are eating a clown. <laughs> and what does one say to the other? He tastes a bit funny. <laughs> He tastes a bit funny. Oh, he tastes a bit oh, because he's a clown. Oh, that was a good joke, my friend. You made me laugh. Oh, so now I... No, he's fitting. Unless I counted wrong, I've now done three of you a favor. So, how do I cross the water? Walk. Ha ha. You might be able to walk on water, and what about ice? Ice. Haven't you noticed how cold it is here? That doesn't look like ice. So? And you couldn't have just told me that. Would it have been as satisfying that way? Probably not. But you'd better hope nothing happened to Remy just because you delayed me. Remy must have figured out that the lake was frozen on his first act. He probably went straight. Hmm. It looks like water, but it's actually a child's play. Ah! Whoa! Ah! Whoa! No problem at all. No, Wilbur. It's a trap. You! You will bring me the wand that this thief stole years ago. Kim, look to me, Stash. Who? Who are you? I am the gatekeeper. You! You're the ghost of one of those mages that wanted to free the nameless one, right? The nameless one must never be allowed. No? I mean, neither I nor Remy want that, so why are you fighting us? He stole the wand. The wand is the key. Bring me the key. Wypuść Remiego jest ranny. Let Remy go free. He's badly in. He will die if you don't bring me the magic wand. I don't have the magic wand anymore. Then retrieve it. Your friend doesn't have my. Oh! Przeniesienie różdżki potrwa za długo. We don't have that much time. We have to. Your friend is growing weaker by the second. But we can't. Ah!
All right, all right. I'll think of something, Remy. I know you. Czyli bez różdżki nie uratujemy Remiego. I have to get Remy out of there as quickly as possible. He seemed so weak. Maybe, maybe I can somehow sneak past the ghost. No będziemy kombinowali, jak uwolnić Remiego, bądź jak zdobyć różdżkę. Ale zajmiemy się tym już w kolejnych odcinkach. A tymczasem dzięki wielkie za uwagę. Trzymajcie się, hej!